What is in vitro fertilization and why is it problematic? In vitro fertilization, otherwise known as IVF, involves giving a woman drugs to induce ovarian hyperstimulation. Then a doctor surgically removes her eggs. These eggs are combined with sperm in the laboratory. Then the embryos are returned to the woman's uterus. There are many profound ethical issues involved with the use of IVF. First, IVF damages the marriage bond because it dissociates the sexual act from the procreative act. With IVF, children are not brought into existence by an act of spousal love under God's embrace. IVF also objectifies children. Donum Vitae says, The child is not an object to which one has a right, nor can he be considered as an object of ownership. Rather, a child is a gift. A child is not a mere possession that can be acquired at will, but IVF treats a child as a commodity that may be obtained by any possible means. Moreover, many human embryos are killed or discarded during the process of IVF. Rarely does a single transplanted embryo survive the entire process. Even when using multiple eggs, the probability of achieving pregnancy per IVF cycle is only about 1 in 3. This means that multiple embryos die in the process. IVF also requires the intentional killing or abandonment of many surplus human embryos. Sometimes, embryos in a lab are considered defective by reproductive specialists. These embryos are discarded as mere biological waste. Nearly 3 million embryos worldwide die this way each year. Other times, multiple embryos survive, so the woman becomes pregnant with twins, triplets, or more children. Often these women resort to pregnancy reduction abortions. Other times, more embryos are formed than are needed. These extra embryos are frozen in cryopreservation. Later, these embryos may be thawed and injected into another woman. However, frozen embryos only have a 60% chance of surviving the thaw. Clearly, IVF is problematic on many levels. It damages the marriage bond between spouses and treats children as mere commodities that can be formed, used, and killed at will. After fertilization, IVF completely ignores that embryos are unique human individuals whose lives must be respected, protected, loved, and served. Most of these children are left to die. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and turn on notifications to stay connected to the conversation.